I'm David Berlin with Information Week TV. I'm coming to you from Mobile World Congress in Barcelona, Spain, where we're on the hunt for the latest, greatest, hottest technology. And we've stumbled upon a booth that specializes in technology for senior citizens. Now, you're wondering why I have these, where they look like 3D glasses on and this glove. And the answer is, is that these glasses and this glove help young people like me, or younger people, because I'm actually 50, understand what it feels like to be a senior citizen trying to use a phone like a BlackBerry. It's literally impossible to press the buttons because your fingers are impaired from moving. Older people may have, senior citizens may have arthritis or some other ailment that pre prevents them from having the dexterity that younger people have. These glasses help me to understand how blurry and how difficult it is to see the display on these phones. This company makes specialized phones that are designed to make it much easier for senior citizens to operate the phone, to see the display, to push the buttons. Standing with me to tell me about that is Karen Schaumberger. She's the Chief Marketing Officer with Emporia. So I want to thank you for joining us here, Karen. Thanks a lot for coming. So Karen, tell me a little bit about these phones. What makes them so special? So these phones are very easy to operate. And the nice thing is you even can see it in a big distance. You can read everything, who is calling you, what's happening. So, so very high contrast, yeah. big letters on the, yeah. not just big letters on the buttons, but also big letters on the display. Yeah, it's important for user comfort. And the nicest feature on bar types is uh, the kind of keypad lock. So people always worry that they call someone by accident. And if you really have it here, you can see it all. Nothing can happen. Everything's good. Now there's a bunch of buttons on the side of this phone. And there are other phones like this one. So um, I'm just going to pick up. Uh, uh, there this we go. One, yeah. This is the, these two are essentially the same phone. Yeah. Um, kind of stylish. Uh, but they have the same buttons on the side. Very easy to press volume buttons. Like if you're used to using mm -hmm. a smartphone or something like that, sometimes hard to find that stuff. Lock buttons on the other side. You have uh, buttons for texting and alarm. I see that here. Um, what's the back? What's on the back here on the ruggedized version? So we have here a call for care button. Yep. And with this call for care button, uh, it can be really forwarded to an emergency uh, hotline or to someone who is going with you for a trip. Right. And it also has integrated the full motion sensor. That means people who would use this mobile are either very active seniors or people who have this mobile as a second phone when they're doing outdoor, or people working in the security industry. And there it's very important that they have this kind of call for care button, GPS localization, drag and trace, but also a full motion sensor to have a best friend. So if I get hurt, I press that button, it's going to you know, summon the emergency services to come yeah. get me. Right? So, or somebody. Yeah, yeah. either it, get, it gets to the international help call or if you are uh, subscribed to someone, it, it can be the nurse who is dealing with you every day to help you and to provide you additional information or whatever you need. Now these are relatively basic phones. Yeah. They don't have a lot of features to them, nothing like today's smartphone. No. But what if I'm a senior and I really want some of the smartphone features that that my kids have oh. in their iPhones and Android devices and all that. Thank you for this question. <laughs> so we have the Emporia Connect mm -hmm. and this mobile phone it's a clamshell and it's really to connect generations. So it's a basic phone again but you can have first services like you would have some vital function measurement on it where you can then compete with your kids like you have a pedometer in it and you could walk with your grandchild a pedometer, a pedometer yeah, yeah, okay. yeah and you could walk with your grandchild a competition who is doing more steps a day or we have easy to use driver training on it mm -hmm. people would like to get or stay as long as possible independent so there we have these trainings on it, or easy to use picture sharing. Easy okay, so email. one of the things that those two other phones that we were just looking at, they didn't have a camera, no, this one has a camera yeah, on it? Yeah, this has a, a good 3 megapixel camera. You can activate via a side button. Yep. So with two clicks to go, and really sharing very easy. That's nice, because on my iPhone it's like yeah. it's like eight gestures before I get to the camera. Nah, right? and it really, it's nerving. So we would like to close the digital gap between us high advanced digitals and the seniors and make, how to say, it possible that you share nice emotions. There you go, yeah. So you can, uh, for seniors sharing with their kids or grandkids, this has the basic functionality of the information that you yeah. would share between them. And it also comes with really big numbers, very big display, high contrast, good for the eyes. Now, I was spying some of the devices on your table and uh, I saw a wristwatch and I was like, oh, this is oh. kind of a neat wristwatch. It's very basic, kind of stylish, like, you know, 
back to simplicity, one of those watches that goes back to simplicity, but it actually does something special, doesn't it? Yeah, it, it is. Um, and this watch comes together with two of our products, either with the Rocketized or with this product. And it's really our ambient assisted living this, this solution. This is yet another phone. We, we, this is not yeah. the same as, nah, the, not the same as no, this no. one. They look a little bit This is same. our safety phone. You have the red button at the back. And it's really something for people to stay as long as possible in their own home. So for us, it's really an economic topic that seniors uh, are longer alive. They would like to enjoy life and to stay independent and mobile, uh, they are using this kind of phone. So what happens here? What, what they so work you would wear your watch and you could uh, make an emergency alert via the watch. From the watch? Yeah, from the watch. So like uh, if you don't have the phone with you, you have the watch on your wrist, yeah. something happens, you fall, you fall, yeah. you can't get up, you need help. It would help. Press the button yeah. on the watch. It would watch localize you. Communicates yeah. to the phone, yeah. and and it's essentially the same thing as pressing the red yeah. button on the back. Of course. How do these two communicate over what sort Via of? Via our F frequencies. Uh -huh. And it's really like you would be in the garden. The phone is in the living room. Something happens. You press the button. It gets in connection and gets directly to the helpline. Okay. And uh, what keeps this phone? Uh, I'm sorry. This watch charged up because. Radios are famous for draining the battery life yeah. in them. No, that's the point why we don't have Bluetooth or something. Right. It's really, we have a special battery in it and the radio frequency ensures uh, that you don't have to store the battery. So the battery goes for three years uh, oh. Oh. and that's quite nice. All right, now uh, I was looking at this. This is sort of a stylish version of what you have, a little more thin and and uh, flat. Uh, is this a special compared to the other phones? No, it's the same. It's an easy to use phone and it's called the Emporia Essence. Mm -hmm. It comes with the, the handy gar with the cradle. We say it's the garage for the handy. And it's really something uh, in a lot of countries we sell this as a, how to say, perfect substitute for uh, fixed line phones. Right. So people would have this phone at home and would use a normal smartphone for going abroad. I see. And this also has the, uh, yeah, the call heart. for care. Button. Not all of them have the call for care button. No, but this it's one does, yeah. uh, dedicated to the segments. But what we learn is that from a segment starting with 33, uh, security and safetyness is very important. And if you have then this one button, it's much easier than dialing 112 or whatever. And this is what where we believe it's a nice USP towards the target group. Now, one really important question for all of our members out of, of the Information Week audience in the U.S. is. Are these phones available in the U.S. now? Uh, starting with early May, mm -hmm. after CTIA, they are available in the U.S. market. Right, already th through existing yeah. uh, carriers, they're going to be selling. Through this existing one. carriers and retailers. Okay, well, Karen Schaumberger, <laughs> Chief Marketing Officer with Emporia, thanks very much. Have a Thank great you show. too. Thank you. Yeah, there we are from Mobile World Congress. So you see some phones that are especially for seniors. Maybe you have a parent who needs a phone like that. I'm David Berlin for Information Week TV.